you can smile with your mouth and it can be fake but whatever you smile do with your eyes that's like the window to your soul right honoring our heroes that's what one montreal artist has set out to do with her new portrait series the faces of covid19 featuring more than 20 nurses doctors and patient physicians at the muhc royal victoria hospital I saw how grateful and thankful the nurses and, and, and patient attendants and other physicians were seeing it, and it was sort of a, a mood elevator for our department. This is the photo that caught local artist Marja Hogan's eye. A family friend in a Care Bear cloth mask and striped cap, something that was a common sight early in the pandemic as medical supplies dwindled, forcing many healthcare workers to make do without medical grade protective gear. It was just really cute, you know, and I thought, oh, I love that. So I want to do a pair of a little portrait of it, just kind of as a souvenir to thank him. And it took off from there. Before she knew it, Hogan had painted 20 portraits with more on the way. Other local artists have also turned to frontline workers as the subjects of art pieces. Patrick Forchild painted a six-story mural on the Jewish General Hospital wall, representing support and compassion for frontline workers during the COVID-19 pandemic. Hogan's 8 by 8 inch paintings will be on full display on the Royal Vic emergency room walls this fall, after which they'll be donated to the subjects of each painting. It's just amazing how, particularly a lot of them, I mean, she's captured the, the, the image. You look at the painting and, you know, even with the mask on, you know exactly who it is in the department. And she just captures the eyes and so she's really good. And people are very flattered. If anybody we want to be grateful to, it's our doctors, our nurses, you know, all the different healthcare workers, the patient attendants. I want it to be a souvenir of a difficult time, but... That is a reminder of what a wonderful job they were doing. In Montreal, Sharon Union Reynolds, City News.